white flag is out. Final circuit. If anyone's saving anything, it's got to show now, Matt. But out in front, leader comes up on lap traffic. Tim Sullivan, Brian Sullivan moving in. They come to the stripe. Nick Hatton has done it. He'll take down the win. And Tim Sullivan will finish in second. Brian Sullivan for third. Hayden, what a run, man. The 41 car looking so tough tonight. It's your fourth victory of the year. That looked like a lot of fun out there. Yeah, it definitely was a lot of fun. We got a lot more competition here for the Friday night show. And uh, I had to start mid-pack and made a few adjustments after the heat race, and it seemed to work out. Final time to the bottom of turn number one. Bloxham is there. Provost is closing up the gap. Matt, will he be able to pull it off in turn three? He has two turns in which to make a move. Bloxham still dominating. Lavoie holding off Saunders. And here comes Robert Bloxham toward the finish line. Finishing in second behind Robert Bloxham is Dwayne Provost. Jeremy Lavoie is third. Okay, Robert Bloxham going to victory lane, man. The 33 car stood up to the challenge tonight, man. You had the champ right on your rear bumper and uh, did a heck of a job out there. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, that was crazy. Just every lap, you got to see Dwayne Provost in your rear mirror. That's um, pretty daunting, but he raced me clean. Didn't touch me once. He was fast. We were both fast, but I um, always liked racing with him. It was a good race. But Bayer had some ammunition coming off of turn number three, and he reestablishes himself in the lead with one lap to go. Walker and Robinson mounting the one-two punch behind him. If Trace Bayer is going to win number two on the season, he is going to have to beat out the point leader, Zach Robinson. Zach Robinson with a power move, moves into second. He's close. Is he going to be a factor as they cross the line in just a second off turn number four? Trace Bayer will hold down and take down the win. Zach Robinson to finish in second, Walker for third. Okay, Trace Byer, man, absolute cakewalk until. What were you thinking, man? The caution flag comes out, just about ready to take the white flag. Uh, wow. Man, I was out for a Sunday drive. I mean, this car was handling beautiful. It couldn't get any better. But uh, as soon as that caution came out, man, you cannot be more worried with guys like Zach Robinson and Johnny Walker behind you. I mean, they're the best in this division. So. I just had to figure out how to hold them off, but once I got through uh, turns three and four and I cleared Johnny, I knew I was home free. That was, that was awesome. The white flag is out, and Leary. And the consultation flag is coming out. Car number 31 is being black flagged for over-aggression on the racetrack. Here is Tyler Leary, he is in the clear. Checkered flag is out for the first time ever. Tyler Leary has won at Stafford. You know what, tonight had a special feeling to it. Uh, the gorgeous sunset coming down, it was a nice cool night for racing. I just had that feeling waiting out behind that backstretch tonight. I said, I'm gonna go out and win this damn race. Final circuit. He's overcome the bad luck, the hard luck. Marcello Raffato is dialed in tonight. And Jimmy Fuller's setup with Marcello Raffato will get the black and whites. Marcello Raffato will visit Victory Lane. Brett the Jet Gagne for second. Corey DiMatteo to finish among the top three. Marcello Raffato, man, congratulations. I'll tell you what, the 88 car was absolutely flying tonight. Some nice restarts there, and that, that car, I'm telling you, and the driver was just awesome. Yeah, we, we have to do everything 100% tonight. I can't thank Jim Fuller enough for doing the final tune-ups on this car to get this thing at Victor Lane tonight. I also can't thank my family and my friends enough and my crew for getting this car in Victor Lane tonight. Go so, and Owen. We'll see if Owen can take second for the second consecutive race. But right now, the spotlight is shining brightly on the 50 of Chase Dowling. Final circuit. Chalk up another victory to the kid that everyone's talking about. Chase Dowling puts the SNS paving. Adam Scavora race car in victory lane. And Galco was able to hold off Owen to finish in second.
Hey, Dowling, man, I'll tell you what, the 50 car coming up from 12th place tonight. Had to pass a lot of superstars. You did it with ease, man. High, low, no matter what. What a ride. Yeah, it was a pretty crazy race. Um, we had old tires from last week and we had an accident, but you know, this is a rebound team this week, and say. We had the racks and we came back and win. We had a motor go, come back and win, and that's what it's all about is coming back and winning an A+. Plus and, uh, had a good run up there. I got I almost wrecked her one in the one that one lap and hit the wall around the back stretch. It was all over the place. But uh, this car just shows that week in, week out, it's got the long run speed. That's what it's all about. And when those cautions don't come, this car is going to be the one to watch.